but they haven't really developed the skills to focus all their energy into one lane and stay there for a long period of time. Hey, what's going on? This is Catelyn and today I've been working basically the full day on my uh, on a training that I'm doing for the team and um, a training that also like the training is basically composed of social media training then Facebook training then uh, uh, marketing training and so on and so forth so it's basically a really structured thing that I'm working on doing because um, I feel like this is the next step into our evolution into us becoming able to scale faster without requiring me and or my high-level people's time uh, and this will also uh, play a major role in something that we're going to do in the future which is digital products which is um, offering a digital um, having a digital offering to our services and so on and so forth so it's really interesting in order for me to kind of take my knowledge, my intrinsic, my subconscious knowledge, my instinctual knowledge from which some of it is conscious but most of it it's unconscious, right? Um, that I've learned all by myself and all these things. In order to do that, I basically have to get into a completely different mind space and in order to get into that mind space, in order to get into that focus of breaking down my own behavior into a, into a mind space of complete self-analysis, um, I really have to be completely focused on that. And I've realized because I've, and I'm just sharing this with you because some of you may need to do like deep, I call this deep work, right? Uh, so some of you may need to do deep work and you need to know these things. So let me share with you my experiences. So in order for me to go into that headspace of really understanding my subconscious behaviors and taking those subconscious behaviors and putting them into, sub into the conscious behaviors and now actually behaviors or knowledge, whatever that is, and actually, actually now being able to take that knowledge and to put it on paper for other people to understand, that requires a lot of empathy, focus, and really self-analysis. So those three things, empathy, focus, and self-analysis. So if you're doing deep work, right, if you're doing high-level strategy, how can we completely do something different that we're doing right now? Or if you innovate, or if you want to create a training program like I am, but I think the principle is much deeper than that, I think you need to develop these three things. Empathy, focus, and self-analysis to a much bigger level, right? In order to actually achieve that deep work, which is, in my opinion, some of the highest revenue, some of the highest recurring, uh, high, some of the highest ROI on your time that you could do, you need to develop those traits and most people don't have them because one, they're spending too much time in chaos or in sound disturbances or in places or environments they cannot focus or two, they haven't really developed the skills to focus all their energy into one lane and stay there for a long period of time. For example, me, I've started working on this training to, to, to uh, this morning, it was not really morning, uh, 12.30 p.m. and this is 7.45 p.m. So basically six hours straight of like non, I haven't stopped, haven't took any breaks, basically like 15 minute break and that's it. And that really, that's really the way I work, but that, that's how I feel you sustain that level of deep thinking. Please, 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 if you're doing deep thinking in your, in your life and in your work, which is what innovation should come out from and what outside of the box thinking really is, please develop these things. For me, it's finding a quiet place like my home um, and really drilling hard into finding solutions to problems that I'm looking forward to solve. And that for me right now is a training program, but it will be a 
completely different and innovative content strategy or it will be a completely new approach to getting clients or um, to outreach or to maintain clients or to um, uh, train or manage better employees, whatever that is, a new strategy for our company. Like I'm taking these times for myself and they're so, so productive. Um, I think most of us should do that. Let me know if this makes sense. Um, I'm gonna jump off right now from this quick vlog that I'm doing with you and I'm gonna go and get something to eat. I'm gonna get some, some stuff to do, like a beautiful, amazing, gorgeous salad. And then I'm gonna continue with something else that I wanna work on, which is a content strategy. So, um, yeah, beautiful things. I like this, I like deep thinking. It's really rewarding and I think a lot of us should do it a lot more. So, let's go, let's get a salad. If you can find people that you can learn from and spend time around those people and stop spending time with your, with your friends that are not bringing you anything because that doesn't help.